Oh, somebody that called me just yesterday to tell me that, oh, when I come back from my trip, I would uh, do this, I will do that. But God did not permit that, and we just heard that she died. That was Shola Taiwo recounting the events preceding her auntie's death. Many Nigerians would refer to her demise as sudden death. What do people really understand is sudden death? Except you tell me because I don't understand. When something happens, emergency, something that you didn't know that is going to happen. Somebody just died without uh, God's uh, proposal for him or her. This respondent narrates his experience. My sister had a sudden death, motor accident. For some Nigerians, death can never occur naturally. It has to be a spiritual attack by use of what has come to be known in this country as remote control. It is not God's wish, it's Satan's wish, and then it's witchcraft. Sometimes wicked uncle, wicked brother, self, wicked sister, all of them, they are caused suddenly dead. How true is this? Jacob Machiku, a medical doctor, speaks from the sphere of his discipline. You, you cannot blame anybody to attribute it because of the frightening and terrifying nature to anything depending on the belief system in the environment. So they can attribute it, maybe somebody in the village was pursuing or attacking by small remote control or they have sent arrow. We can't blame anybody because they don't understand the scientific basis behind it. But the truth is that there have been risk factors accumulating over the years, undiscovered, uncorrected. With the doctor agreeing that undiagnosed ailments whose symptoms do not manifest early or at all can cause sudden death. The next question was, how many Nigerians actually do medical checks regularly or at all? Uh, once in a long while. How many months? How many years? I cannot remember. Like four times. How? Where and how? At Isolo General Hospital. Okay. And I check my BP. Somebody like me, I don't think I have ever just gone to the hospital on my own without being sick. This question will never be overflogged. Why is it that most Nigerians do not take time to check the status of their health until it is perhaps too late? Most times I know I take care of my health by myself because I know some certain things I can do to take care of my health. So many people might not have enough money. Yeah, I'm a hustler, you understand? So I don't really have time for all those things. Well, Dr. Wachuku gives some of the risk factors to sudden death as hypertension, high cholesterol and obesity. So other additional factors may be cigarette smoking, family history, and then of course advancing age. Now, when people don't go for check, they may not be aware that they carry any of these risk factors. Hmm, you need to know more. So we say, oh doctor, I don't have blood pressure. No, you don't have blood pressure means the heart is no longer beating, blood is no longer flowing. I presume the person wanted to say doesn't have hypertension or that the blood pressure was normal. Because as long as the heart is beating, blood circulates, and the measurement of the force with which the blood is flowing is called blood pressure. When it's measured with normal instrument, with normal procedure, and it's less than 140 over 90 in any adult, it's said to be normal. And it's when it's higher than 140 over 90 and above consistently, we say the person is having hypertension. Of course, this hypertension will not give any signal by way of symptoms. And complications may occur, stroke, kidney failure, heart attack, and of course, sudden death. Now you know that Sudden death is not when somebody dies of an ailment, but as a result of an accident, for example. The best way to live long in good health, therefore, doctors advise is for people to take issues concerning their health seriously. Take more of fruits and vegetables and to balance all this, you exercise on a regular basis so that what the body does not need is burnt off and you remain more physically and medically fit. And above all, you must have simple tools to check your blood pressure at home, check your blood sugar at home, check your cholesterol at home.